I believe in Allah. I believe in myself. Do you believe in Allah? Do you believe in yourself? We must believe in Allah. Let's believe in ourselves. Everybody, one to go. Let's sing together. I believe in Allah. I believe in myself. Do you believe in Allah? Do you believe in yourself? Let us believe in Allah. Let's believe in ourselves. Yes, thank you everybody. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Sit down. Good day everyone. I am Halima Tadani Baluku. I am an entrepreneur. I render educational services to individuals and group of learners. Today, we want to talk about believing in yourself. What does it mean to believe in oneself? What does it mean, what does it mean to believe? Belief is the feeling of being certain that something exists or is true. So if you believe that something is true about you or correct about you, that means you believe in yourself. Our life is full of experiences and everything we experience in our daily lives confirms to us what we can do and what we cannot do. Why do we have to believe in ourselves? Can anybody tell me? Yes, you're right. We ought to believe in ourselves because we are so endowed, we are wonderfully made by Allah, our Creator. He has endowed us with talents and He has blessed us with limbs. We can move, we can think, all right, we can make things happen. We should also know that, I mean, the fact that you and I are, are blessed, we can think, we can do things, therefore, we, we are able to carry out one act or the other. When we attempt something and we are able to achieve it, that confirms to us that yes, we can do that thing. When we attempt another one and it appears, wow, we do not have such strength, it confirms to us we cannot do that thing. But the crime, in, there is no crime in failing, but the, the fault is in not making attempt at all, is what scholars say. Therefore, let's take for example, um, every woman, every woman cooks, right? Yes, every woman cooks. So let's imagine a situation whereby a group of women are put together at a place and they are given the same set of ingredients to prepare a meal. When they do so, do you agree with me that the taste of the food they are going to cook at the end of the day is not going to be exactly the same? Yes, because as we are different physically, emotionally and everything, we can do things differently. Definitely, even when we do the same thing, we'll be getting different results. That is because we, are, we as individuals are created by Allah in a special way, we have, he has brought us to this life to fulfill a certain purpose. Therefore, it's, it's, more, it's a major reason we have to believe in ourselves because we are specially made. Every human being is created for a particular purpose. For that reason, we must believe in ourselves that yes, whatever it is we, we, we feel we should do, would attempt it. When we achieve it, yes, it confirms to us that we can do it. Can you see on my screen? There I have the picture. What do you see? You see the picture of the cat and the lion, isn't it? The cat is the one looking at itself in the in the mirror. And it's what the picture he sees is that of what? A lion. It's a cat, but it sees itself as a lion. So that's a self-belief. You may be young, but you may be so mature in mind. You may have the ability to do what an elderly person does. You should never be intimidating. Rather, you go ahead to do what you, you know is certain about you that you can do. So on, on this note, on the final note, I leave you with this quote. That no one 
can make you feel inferior without your consent. If you truly want to res be respected by people who love you love, if you truly want to be respected by people you love, you must prove to them that you can survive without them. Believe in Allah, believe in yourself, and I believe in you. Thank you for listening. I am Halima Jani Bye.